Hello gamers! Season of Discovery added a new reputation grind for each faction, names on screen. Reaching Honored with this faction gives you a 12 slot bag and a rune for each class. I'd say it's fair to assume future reputation levels will also reward more runes as well, so even if you don't need a rune right now, I'd get ahead of it while you can. You gain reputation with this faction by turning in waylaid supplies at supply officers. These officers can be found outside of any auction house in a major city. Before we get into the farm, it's important to note that the crates themselves have item levels that correspond to what reputation level they give Rap and Till. For example, level 115 mobs drop item level 10 crates, and these crates only give Rep up until friendly. If you want to reach Honored, you will need level 25 crates. Future phases are not out yet to know for sure, but it's a fair assumption to extrapolate from this data and assume that future crates will be level 40 and 60 and correspond to Revered and Exalted, as shown on screen. Waylaid supply crates are a 0.1% drop from any mob in the zone, and they're unique, so you only have one at a time. This makes them a pain to farm with any consistency. However, I have noticed they have around a 70-80% to 80 drop rate from chests, so my method for grinding Honored in 4 hours was to install an add-on like GatherMate and import the treasure data to see treasure chests on my map. I then map a route from any major city to a nearby chest hotspot. For example, from Stormwind, you can go south to the Null Camps, or in Ironforge, you could head to the Troll Mountains to the west. Go there, look for a chest, hopefully it has a crate in it, and then head back to the city to turn it in. However, whenever possible, buy materials from the auction house to fulfill the crate. They are worth a lot more reputation when you fill them up. Using level 25 crates as an example, an empty crate gave me 200 rep, whereas basic crafting materials such as bronze bars gave 500 rep, and a crate of crafted materials like bronze boots gave 800 rep. So unless you just absolutely cannot afford the materials, it is definitely worthwhile as these crates are a pain to find, so you want to milk as much reputation as possible out of them. Make sure you fully loot the chest, even stuff you don't want. Chests won't respawn unless they are fully emptied. Do this until you reach friendly, at which point it's time to farm level 25 chests. Choose any zone with mobs above level 15 that is near a capital city to reduce travel time. For example, I chose Red Ridge as I could quickly fly, check the Null Camps for crates, then fly back to Stormwind. This is a giant pain, but it's the best way I've found for reputation. For future updates, repeat this for zones using the level ranges I posted earlier. If future updates come and my guesses were wrong, I will update the ranges in a comment down below. I will not make a new video. As a side note, if you carry the materials to fill a crate on you when you find one, this will allow you to carry one extra crate, but it's typically not worthwhile to do it intentionally, as chest respawn timers are around 7 minutes, you could have already went and flown back to the city anyway, and gotten back before it respawned. I'm sorry I'm not giving specific areas to farm, but it's up to how popular your area is on your server, what you need to farm, etc. Just get an add-on like GatherMate and find a spot that works for you nearby a capital city. I hope this helps you all. Until next time gamers, toodles.